Good morning everyone. Today we are at Epcot here at Walt Disney World for the grand opening of Walt Disney World's brand new annual pass holder pop-up shop that opens today, October 14th. It will only be open for a limited time and we're gonna get a first look. We're gonna give you all the details once we get inside. We're gonna come back and get a look at an update on the pylons, but look, there's some like scaffolding going on over here. Good morning, Spaceship Earth. We're actually in the park before it's even open to the public. It is so peaceful and beautiful. When I first pulled up this morning, Epcot was covered in fog. It was so cool. The pop-up shop is gonna be located in the Germany Pavilion. We've made our way over here. We're getting closer. We're here so early that we can hear the peaceful, quiet music of the Germany Pavilion. It's very beautiful in the morning. Well, it's beautiful always, but it's time. Thank you. This is the very first annual pass holder pop-up shop Disney has ever done here at Walt Disney World. If you want a pizza purse, they've got you on a pizza purse. Here we go. We're starting with the pass holder shirts. They're pass holder branded shirts. There are quite a few new pass holder shirts that I haven't seen before. I do have the regular Halloween 2020 shirt, but haven't seen this one. I love how all over the store, they have the annual pass holder logo, just to remind you that that's what is going on in this shop. This shop's also a way to get some nice cold AC. Look at that plane they've got up there. That's really cool. And the beautiful German decor because it's in the Germany pavilion. Oh, I love seeing the Christmas stuff. This annual pass holder pop-up shop, the grand opening is today, October 14th. There's already a line of guests outside waiting to get in and it will be open through November 17th. Only on weekdays starting at 11.30 through park close. So this is a limited time offering. Besides annual pass holder merchandise, it's also going to feature world showcase merchandise. Ooh, I really like this. That is very, very cute. I feel like I need that. They've even got pass holder phone cases. How cute is that? And it's Chef Mickey, so you can show off your pass holder pride with the best chef in town. Of course, if you need me, I'll be at my happy place. We all, we, we can all feel that. We feel the feels. I actually really love this one too. It's a giant Mickey. This is my happy place magnet. This seems to be one of the hotter items and these are pass holder exclusive magic bands. They're brand new. They've got different colors. They've got this pink one with Minnie that is super cute. They've got an orange one with Mickey also super cute. We were just told that these items were originally intended for Disneyland Paris and they couldn't get them over there. So they've got them for sale here. They are beautiful, exclusive items. We were also just told this is the only Disney romper on Walt Disney World property that you can buy. And it is very cute. I feel like those are gonna get snapped up. This is like a unique tie in the front shirt. That's really cute and different. I like this chic mini, very cute with the dots. Look at this bag. Get a little bit of Disneyland Paris, there you go. When I went to Disneyland Paris, I actually did a hunt looking for merch and they didn't have a lot of cute stuff. If they would have had this, I would have gotten something. We've got another wall of Paris themed items here, colognes and scents. This part smells really good. <sighs> Just breathing in that delicious smell. You stand by this wall, all fresh, so fresh. Oh, they have the cutting boards. I actually got that from Food and Wine Festival. Uh, was it last year or the year before? So with any purchase of $50 or more right now, you can get that pass holder cutting board. That's cool. Here are a few more of the magnets. We saw these two, but this one, Happy Halloween 2020 pass holder <laughs> magnet. Very cute. Also right now, pass holders are getting 30% off discount on merchandise park-wide, Walt Disney World-wide. And on top of that, many of these items are discounted at 40 and 50% off on top of the 30%. So this is like deep discounts. They've also got flower and garden items for 50% off. The items that are on sale with this 50% or 40% off, you get your 30% pass holder discount on top of that. These cuckoo clocks are a really unique item and I like that they're working so we can watch them go. Look at it go. 
Also, if you need a giant margarita glass, I know these are from the Mexico Pavilion, but here they are, and they're 50% off. So there's items from all over the World Showcase that you might find in here with these deep, deep discounts. Look, it's an Epcot Mickey. It's got a little Epcot on his foot. It's got World Showcase shorts. There are a lot of really unique items in here, like these beautiful goblets. I'm gonna call them goblets because they are very, very large wine glasses with the Epcot World Showcase. And you see the showcases etched into the back of the glass with the logo on the front. They've also got pass holder flower and garden merch. I really like this figment shirt. He's so cute. He's got all sorts of vegetables and fruits coming off of him out from his imagination. So just chatting with the cast members in the store, I was informed that there will be new items being brought in weekly to this store. So if you see something you like, you should probably grab it because it may not be there the next week. And on top of that, you can check back weekly or as often as you want, because it's really nice in here, to look for new items that are being brought in. And like I said, it's a mix of pass holder exclusive merchandise and World Showcase exclusive merchandise. I also wanna add that I love the Christmas holiday feels in here. So if you want a little bit of holiday feel, this is the spot. Right in the front of the shop when you walk in, there's like a bunch of car stuff and they've got this cute VW stuff and look at these cute bags. Those are awesome. So not everything is discounted, like some of this is full price, but you do get your annual pass holder 30% off. So you're getting a discount one way or another. Oh, look, there's Belle and Aurora. Oh my gosh, princesses. Jasmine and Snow White. I can see them going by. Hello princesses. We just walked out and I just noticed there's a sign here that says return here for virtual wait list. So that makes me think there's gonna be a virtual queue for this. You walk up, maybe give your phone number or check in through the app or something like that. And then they'll call you back when it's your turn. That was a very cool first look. And just so you guys know, we did go back outside of the store and put ourselves in the regular virtual queue to go back in to shop. So we didn't buy anything on that first look, we just looked. I also wanna mention that Disney did invite us out for this preview today. Thank you so much, Disney. And they did provide us with gift cards to enjoy a little bit of food and wine festival. Anybody can purchase these gift cards on bracelets. They're a really convenient way to do festivals. You don't have to take your wallet in and out. You don't have to touch anything. You just use it, bam, 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 go through. And you can also set how much you wanna spend in advance. We're back in. We walked outside, got on the virtual queue, and within like, what, 10 minutes? We're back in to do a little shopping. They're limiting the amount of people in the store. Also, they are checking your annual pass holder card and your ID. If you don't have the card, you can show your My Disney Experience app, but you do need to show some sort of photo identification to prove you're a pass holder to get in here. Just to show you guys how quick things go, this was open for how long? Two uh, minutes. Yeah. About 15 minutes. Yeah, yeah. and they got minutes. wiped out. Wiped out. Yeah. And they're restocking. That's wow. That's insane, isn't it? Oh, wow. Well, wow. What do you guys think? Are you getting one? I already got one. Yep. Oh, I need I'm one getting, too. I'm getting the classic. I'm getting Mickey, gotta yeah. Get Gotta get but the classic Mickey. Mind. Wow, they were wiped out and they just restocked. Oh, yeah. Are you gonna get one too, Jenna? We're all getting one. We're gonna be matchy. <laughs> These Norway jackets are so incredibly nice and they normally go for $175 using your 30% discount and they're in the 50% off section. That is pretty hefty and they've got black and white. They've also got these cute Norway hats. I really like them. Now I'm looking at all the stuff like I didn't get to look at in depth on our first time around. Let me show you guys my haul. I got the World Showcase Mickey. The World Showcase Mini. I got the Pass Holder Magic Band. I got this awesome bag. I got this cute shirt that I showed you guys inside. I got a really cute World Showcase hoodie that I'll be wearing on the one cold day of the year here in Florida. You'll see me wear that. And with a purchase of $50 or more, you get either the cutting board or the wooden coasters. I already have the cutting board, so I got the coasters. Nice. The 
chimes are one of the most unique features here in the Germany Pavilion. We're done with the shopping and now it's time to eat because you know what? All that shopping made me hungry. We're gonna get something from the China Pavilion here. In the Norway Pavilion, thank you so much. They have the best relaxation station. The AC is blasting cold when you walk in. It feels amazing. All right, and we have got ourselves a table here, food and drinks, and we're literally the only people in here. This is, you guys, this is really cool. Everybody's in line for Frozen. All right, we've got the bayo bun and we've got the dumplings and I got a jasmine beer. We're gonna dig in. Jenna joined us and we all had a lovely time chatting and eating. Isn't it nice in here? It's amazing, oh the AC. Oh my gosh. Our, our this is our jam. So we're gonna take off now, but we'll see you very soon. Resort TV One is also gonna have a vlog of this lovely day. Thank you. <laughs> see you soon. Bye. That felt so good. I feel like refreshed and re-energize delicious food, delicious drink, cold AC. This is definitely the best spot in Epcot right now on a hot day. You can bring food in here and there's a restroom in here, an air conditioned restroom. But it is time to venture back out into the sun. Yeah, I got high hopes for Test Track. <laughs> there is a huge line just to get inside the Mexico Pavilion right now, so we're gonna skip over that. That's interesting. I know that has been happening, but this is the first time I've seen it, and it's a random weekday. Yeah, today's Wednesday, and there's also a huge line for margaritas. Wow. It's Margarita Wednesday. I just noticed how low the water level is here. That's interesting. You don't see that every day. So just thought I'd document it. What kind of fish are those, you think? I think, I don't know. I think they're cichlids. Think that big one's a tarpon? No, right? It's kind of got that like under mouth thing, but Siglets, I'll take it. I had this idea in my head that we were gonna ride test track. That is not happening. Oh, bummer. We were gonna come over to try Donut Box. This has recently reopened, but it looks like it's only open certain days, maybe weekends. Definitely not Wednesdays, or at least not this Wednesday because wah wah. Donut plan thwarted. No donuts today. As Look at we us. Gather, as we gather <laughs> around, the, around fire. the fire. <laughs> like elementary school before lunchtime. This is hysterical. Oh, we're all on the floor because we're <laughs> trying to get shade. It's so hot. We finished up eating and I feel like no day at Epcot is complete without at least one ride. Take a ride on trusty old living with the land. Always a favorite. Ah, oh, the soothing music of living with the land. Welcome to Living with the Land. Now, sit back, relax, and enjoy this is Living with the, the Land. I was say, what are you Welcome to a voyage of discovery and awareness of the richness, the diversity, the often surprising nature of living with the land. They've up the lightning ante. I like it. Welcome to our living laboratory where scientists from Epcot and the U.S. Department of Agriculture are exploring innovative ways to produce bountiful harvests now and into the future. I really like this circular planter here with a watering pot with like dangling jewels hanging out of it, like a chandelier. That is so pretty. Wheat, maize, sorghum, and millet, plus rice, account for nearly two thirds of our global food consumption. That's really cool, it's like a behind the scenes. I mean, have to pay for the tour. <laughs> a little behind the leaves, if you will. Just got some work going on. Looks like some leaf trimming here at the cucumber thingy. I love the Mickey pumpkin. Look at that. Oh, I need a picture of it. Some of our that best is awesome. ideas that have is been so inspired cute. by nature. They're spraying down all the surfaces. They just spray with those things. <laughs> they spray down and sanitize the entire vehicle. All the high touch surfaces. Good to go. That was a fun ride as always on Living with the Land. Definitely everything is getting a little bit more busy than it used to be. It was pretty much a walk on, but there was a line and like pretty recently, like 
there wasn't any line at all so it's interesting to see this now we got one ride in our system and we did eat some from the food and wine festival earlier but i feel like one more food and wine dish will make our day complete so much of epcot is still under construction and being gutted it's interesting to see that going on and look at what a beautiful blue day it is too always love that water up we've got the princess cavalcade going by again oh beautiful hello princesses lovely to see you recently they put out food and wine festival exclusive merchandise and i haven't come out to take a look at it yet so i just want to show it to you guys my favorite thing is this sweater or jumper as my UK friends call it. That is so ridiculously cute. Look at the like rainbow sleeves, the figment, all the fruit and cheese and oh, I love it. I think there's time today for one more food and wine festival treat. I don't know if I'm gonna get something savory, something sweet, it'll be a surprise, but I do know it's gonna be in the air conditioning at World Show Place favorite spot of the festival even though of course the world showcase is beautiful when it's warm out like this this air-conditioned blue beauty is a true savior on a hot day oh my goodness hello oh look at how beautiful it is <laughs> and it feels amazing I also haven't been out to cover this but they added an entire merchandise area into world show place with food and wine festival merchandise maybe we'll take a little look at that after we get something to eat it's some of what we just saw outside and it looks like a little more from here inside the world show place i ordered two things from the apple orchard booth i ordered the charcuterie and cheese plate and then i also ordered the apple blossom sky which comes in a really cool mule cup and the ingredients of that are fanta apple ginger beer Floodwall apple brandy, Burton's Maplewood Farm apple jack brandy barrel aged syrup, and mini marshmallows. Cheers! Looks like a nice little treat. This apple blossom sky drink looks so pretty. It's got marshmallows on it and it smells like fall. It really smells like a fall drink. It's very apple cider smelling. Mm, wow, that's good! Ooh, that tastes like mm, a delicious apple cider. Mm. You know what it tastes like? Like, you know hot apple cider that you get like during the holidays, but frozen, it's like like a frozen slushy. That's so good. Mm. Oh, that's delicious. That is very, very good. It's a slushy. Thank you everybody. Once again, my name is Kelly. Have a great time here to taste of the Cup International Food and Wine Festival. See you in a little bit. Let's go ahead and try. This is definitely a mini charcuterie board. It's very small. It's just like a little, a little sample and a little taste of, of a few different things. Looks like there's even some granola in here. Interesting. Can't go wrong with cheese, meat, and crackers. And you also get to keep the cup. And it's like a cute Moscow mule cup. So I'm gonna rinse it out in the restroom that's inside the pavilion and take it home. And now we'll take a quick look at this shop they've set up at the entrance or exit to World Show Place. I really like this food and wine magic band. I like the rainbow theme they've got going. That's really cool. A lot of figment. Ooh, leggings. Cute. Oh my gosh, they've got like a huge growler. Brews around the world, 25 years. That is really cute. A lot of unique stuff I hadn't seen before. Oh, <laughs> I like that hat. Cool, there are definitely some very cute items in there. I love the rainbow theme, and it's nice to be able to shop in the cold air conditioning. I will tell you what, after how nice it feels in here, we're going back out into the daylight. Oh, whoa. oh it's nice. Definitely warm, but nice. Spaceship Earth glowing in the late afternoon sun. Before we go, of course, we must pay tribute to the pylons. Let's get a better look. Look at them glistening and glowing in the sunlight, beautifully reflecting and refracting all of the light around them. We can't wait for these walls to come down so that we can see them in all of their crystal prismatic glory. Thank you again to Disney, Walt Disney World for inviting us out today to get a first look 
at the Walt Disney World annual pass holder pop-up shop. It was a lot of fun. There's so much cool stuff in there. And again, like I said, they are gonna be rolling out new merchandise week by week. So you're gonna wanna check back. You're also gonna wanna check those park hours. They are open only weekdays from 11.30 a.m. to park close. So there's different park hours each day. So make sure you check in advance. I definitely got a nice haul of stuff. Hopefully you guys can find some cool stuff when you come out too. It's nice for Disney to do something like this for its pass holders. Give us an exclusive shopping place with deep, deep discounts. We get our 30% off right now, plus like many items are 40 and 50% off. So we're gonna head out today. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I'm sending you lots and lots of love. We have tons of fun stuff coming up, so make sure you stay tuned. I'll see you guys for the next video. And until then, as always, stay enthused. Bye.